Hello everyone, and once again, thank you for returning to the Vampire Masquerade playthrough that we, uh, pretty sure we're coming to an end. Uh, I definitely remember the last events of the, uh, last episode where Pink had ultimately betrayed us and we got our good, good friend Wilhelm back. Um, you can see that he has nothing on his person, so I essentially just got him. Oh, he had some. Sorry, he had a couple guns and some black blood, but he had no nothing to protect himself. So I gave him this weird arm that we found. I don't, I don't recognize it in the shield. The you know, give him a little bit. And I, as I loaded up the game, I'm like, man, are we just the weirdest looking group? I, I can't ever imagine. Um. Something I, I kind of overlooked last episode is the fact that, like, you know, when we lost Eric, at least the game was nice enough to give us all the stuff back that Eric was, you know, had in his inventory. Uh, not so much the same can be said with Pink, unfortunately. So we lost all of his uh, armament, I guess you could call it. So... Yeah, I don't really know what to expect. I wanted to pick up right from where we left off because I'm almost certain that there's going to be dialogue at some point that I don't want to miss. Oh, see, that's nice. A nice, quick way to get back up. Uh, the question is, where do I go from here? Uh, Do we... George Thorne is no longer here. A lot of blood, though. Did he escape? Or... No time for wondering. Let's go. Yeah, okay. Well, that was easy to figure out then. George Thorne, if anyone needs a reminder, is the FBI agent that we were sent to come find. Um... Yep, I'm going in the right way. Like I'm seeing doors and stuff, but nothing that tells me like I'm headed in the right direction. Is that there anything? I hate that that... I mean, is that not the, like the same model of the suitcase on the ground that we can't pick up? Um, I don't know if that's something we already picked or not. There's a door. of the door that we came from. Oh, shoot. Okay. Well, if anything, that tells me that maybe we're on the right track. Yeah, this looks like an entrance, if I had to guess. Or not. <laughs> well, I appreciate us. You know, they gave us a door to quickly get through most of... Oh, now we're stuck on a freaking thing. Can we open that up? This is not a great ep start to the episode. Mostly because I'm just like, where are we? Where are we going? I might just have them wait because it's kind of annoying hearing like their footstep follow behind me. Okay, thank God. Let's see if this woman has anything new to say. Time has passed. His time is over. His time is now. I feel like that was different dialogue, but it doesn't really amount to a whole lot. Okay. So let's see what we need to do. Oh, we just need to go to Barclay South. Okay. Well, while we are here, let's see if we can get our good friend Wilhelm some... Is it still Wilhelm? Or does he go... Oh, I figured maybe he adapted... Will as his new new name. Hey, hey, check this out. Ain't these the most beautiful things you ever seen? Well, if he would give us more money than the lady who runs the other shop. So we're just gonna quickly I'm not too worried about money. Like I said, I I wholly believe that we are at least getting close to the end. I'll keep those rounds of ammo because I know that 
Samuel has it. In fact, I might have messed up because I think oh, he had the submachine gun. Shoot. Well, that's fine. I won too. Um, can we get 10, 10, and 10? Wow, that is not any good. Most we can get is armored t-shirt, is that right? A flak jacket. Oh, I hate that we can't get it. Oh, there it is. Tailored armor. Okay, cool. Which he doesn't even have. Okay, so let's get Let's try to get a couple of those guys. Tailored armor. Can we buy more than one? It doesn't seem like it. Oh, we can. Okay, cool. Hey, take her easy. Let's switch to Wilhelm, of course. Or, I guess we'll do Samuel first. Okay, so his appearance doesn't change much, so that's fine. Modified shotgun. What do you have? Modified assault rifle. I have a assault rifle. Yeah. Ooh. Is he wearing a bathrobe? That. No, it's got buttons on it. I don't know why the thick lapel made it look like a uh, a bathrobe to me for some reason. Can we okay. I'm gonna quickly give this to you. I'm sorry that this is like. I I always hate starting the episode out with frivolous things like this. Hey, hey. Check this out. Get rid of the assault rifle. These the most beautiful things you ever seen. Did we ever try the satchel charge? I don't know if we did. Okay, well, let's get Wilhelm a motorcycle helmet. He's got a what you call it melee weapon. I think I'm gonna hold off. Oh, should we get him a, a halberd, just for old times' sakes? I feel like that was his weapon for a good while in the beginning. Um, I think I think yeah, that's a good easy. start. I think that's a very good start. I think I should be more worried about. Um. Our blood supply, because these guys cannot survive without using any sort of blood magic, any chance they get. Okay. I think it'd be quicker to go this way. I'm assuming that we're going to have to sneak around back, because we know that there's like two entrances to the Barclay South. Oh, then that one's locked, so let's quickly come to this shop. Take care of all this. Awaken, awaken, walk the abyss. Scroll with summon soul. I'm not. I don't think I'm ever going to use that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I was say, like, shoot, I forgot to sell the ammo, but if you take it, by all means, be my guest. Okay, do we want anything... Art shield. That would be cool if it wasn't like if it wasn't our main armor. Um, let's just get a bunch of bloodstones. I think that'd probably be the be? best thing for us. Probably a couple of scrolls of awaken can it hurt? I need to distribute these out pretty liberally. That. I'm probably going to need one. Forgot that he had a shotgun. You have a walk the abyss. You know, you can hold on. I'm not going to take that from you. What do you have? You have an awaken. This abyss. Yeah. Get one more bloodstone. 
Actually, what am I thinking? Let's get a couple more. So let's get one more first annual. And another set. And you know what? Let's just... Let's just... Let be. <laughs> make sure that we have plenty to go around. Satchel charge. Right, because then it's... Everyone gets another two. Once again, I apologize for... Not the best start to an episode. I'm sure this isn't the most riveting thing that you've seen today. Okay. Let's heal up. I don't think this fine lady will mind. I guess we can hold on the shotgun for now. It's not hurting anything. Okay. You know what? We just did a lot, so let's save just in case we don't want to lose any progress. I'm kidding, of course. That wasn't anything. So let's head up around to Barclay South. See if we can finally get some revenge on Count Orsi for selling us out. Is it down here? Yes. Okay, cool. So we stepped in here before. And there wasn't anything in here, so this is already different. Go ahead, take the elevator to the top floor. It's the penthouse. It's open and real clean. I don't even think the guy ever lived there. And I mean that. I'm not just trying to sell you the place. I am eager to see Orsi again. I have a gift for him. We seek Orsi. I did business with him long ago, and I owe him a debt. Yeah, then you're about two days too late. He sold the place to me for a song and moved out. Hey, I'm Fred Varney. I'm in real estate. I'm looking for a buyer for the place. Beautiful townhouse, the Barclays South. Moved out? Yeah, he said he'd own the world after New Year's and didn't need just one home. Hey, you going to his party? What party? Oh, sure. Act like you don't know it's New Year's. Come on, you can't fool me. That's why you're dressed up. What means thou? Oh, well, he's on to us, Kristoff. No point in pretending we don't know about Orsi's party. Ah, I see. Yes, his party. Where is it? No idea. You think I got invited? This is for his highbrow friends from the old country. You know, with Euro trash accents. Well, like yours. No offense. None taken. Oh, we lost our invitations. Where is it? No idea. Wish I could help. Can't help. Gotta go. Wait. Got no time. Unless you want to buy Orsi's townhouse. Let us see it. I don't know if that was a hiccup in the dialogue, but it seems weird that Kristoff would ask where it is, and then Lily ask where it is. I don't know. That just seemed a, a bit random to me. Do we... Can we just step into the elevator? How do we get up to the penthouse? Okay, obviously not like that, right? Seeing how that didn't do anything. Am I missing something? Enter or she's... I mean, the guy said that we can go look at it. So, like, what? Oh, psh, oh my god. They made that the smallest switch they possibly could. Ooh, I believe this is the song that was playing at Orsi's Manor all those hundreds and hundreds of years ago. What? It's her palette. Her painter's palette. Alexandra Ruffin, my sire. No, I swear it. This palette is covered with blood. She paints with her own blood. Maybe an artist got mugged. No, I'd recognize her style anywhere. The way she makes his clotted blood is utterly unique. The blood is fresh. She may be nearby. Come. Uh-huh. That seems... not an efficient way to paint. I don't know how you could, like... a whole lot of range of color. Locate the Barclay South storage room. Well, that's probably the back, right? Uh, 
I had to guess? That seems like a very weird thing to do, of like have a whole setup, like a whole place just to find like a clue. Like I think they could have done more with that, that area. Wonder if this is one of those games where maybe things were kind of getting down to the wire and they kind of just had to like speed things along. It's very confusing having the exact same door. That one's just called Door instead of downtown New York, so silly me, I should have been. Should have known that. Uh huh. Is there anything. Well, are you nervous there to see your sire? Don't kill me. I'm almost done. I, I didn't mean to be late, but. I'm so weak. We shall not kill thee. Oh. I, I just need a little more time. And please, more blood. I beg of you, a rat, a little mouse, anything. Alexandra, it's me, Lily. Lily? They've taken you too. Oh, I'd hoped you had escaped. Who hath done this injustice unto you? What? Who imprisoned you here? Your master, Count Orsi. Dry thy crimson tears. We do not serve Orsi. We seek his factory, and we crave his death. I don't know where his factory is. Only that they're coming to take this portrait there for his private New Year's Eve party tonight. I have to finish. If I don't, they'll kill me. No one will kill you. We'll protect you to the end. The end? The end comes soon. Oh, Lily. How sweet to see you again. And how bitter to find you only to lose you again. But we can be together forever. No. No, there is no forever. He's returning. We have to get out of New York. Out of America. There's no place far enough we can run. Peace, woman. What dost thou mean? Oh, good luck. The Tsumitsu demon they made me paint. They resurrect him this night. Then he rises in time to die. Heads up. We've got company. All right. You better be finished, and it better be brilliant. No, it is you who are finished. And that will be brilliant. The address of Orsi's factory. Let us go. My thanks to you, Christoph. Lily tells me you are a great kindred. We are well pleased with her as well. I'd love to paint you. You have a very noble brow. I owe you everything for saving me. Good luck on your mission. May I go with them, Alexandra? Lily, my lovely thrall. It grieves me to let you go so soon after finding you again. But Orsi must die to free you from your bondage. Go, with my blessings, and give Orsi my regards when you crush him like the toad he is. Thank you. Farewell till we meet again, Alexandra. Yeah, that whole thing seemed a little bit of a, uh, a cluster. First of all, wanted to point out that Okay, I was wrong about the blood. She can obviously do some very fine shading. Um, second of all, when would Lily have been able to talk to us or talk to Alexandra about what kind of kindred we are? Second of all, the whole thing, or third of all, the uh, fact that we, we kill some venture and Crystal's like, oh, yes, the address, exactly what we needed. 
I'm starting to believe that there's some truth to my uh, idea that there is a uh, the ending might have been just a little bit rushed. Okay. So are we currently in upstate New York? The sewers, New Moon, Barclay South. Okay, it is. Is it... Oh, wait. Yeah, okay. I I believe we came down here and I accidentally spoiled the fact that I'm pretty sure one of these doors was called something Orsing. I mean, yeah, there's a couple guys right here. Orsi's factory. Hey, where's those guys with the painting? Yeah, where are they? Maybe they got stuck in traffic. They better hurry up. It's almost V-Day. Yeah, V-Day. About time you mooks got here with that painting. Yeah, it's almost V-Day. Well, that was easy. I wonder if you could have forgotten the painting. Also, it seems kind of weird that they didn't question the fact that we don't look exactly like them. Like the guys that we fought. That's some sloppy henchman work. Okay, what the heck is this? I... I noticed that the uh, dungeon name was Orsi Factory Number Four, which definitely feels like we're going to be going to be in here for a minute. Okay, Factory Level One. Well, now that's interesting. It's more of the ominous green liquid. I don't really know what Cash is going to do for us. What I'm assuming is going to be late in the game. Gosh, it is so loud. I don't know what that machinery is, but it is so loud standing next to it. Um. As usual, none of this is ringing a bell. So I'm just going to press forward as best as I can anticipate. Seems a very confusing layout. Come on, break out of the spell, Kristoff. There's just so much stuff going on that just makes it so sonically unpleasing. And so I have to apologize for that. It's like between the factory noises and Lily's chainsaw. What is that? Is that any better? 45, 60, 25, 40, no. Heck no. I'm going to assume we got the best armor in the game for now. Okay, looks like we're on the other side. Got a couple more nameless baddies to take care of. Switch to Lily. I mean, if you guys wanted to attack that dog, I want it. Let's kick some butt. Oh, Lily, I love your <laughs> your need to censor the word and use butt instead. Oh my God. 
That is not what I was anticipating. I mean, I don't think this guy is going to be. Okay. That's not what I was expecting to kill me, seeing how we fought many of these things before. Yeah, see, so he wasn't. Oh. I didn't recognize Samuel with his. with his blue glow, so I thought he was a bad guy. Is that another guy? This layout is kind of. Kind of jarring. Okay. Might as well wait. He's almost dead. Uh oh. Why did. Oh. What happened? Why did. Why did you run down here, Kristoff? Oh, because did you notice a big bad. Evil monster. What's everyone doing? Why is Samuel and Wilhelm not over here? Shoot. Well, this isn't going very well. Huh, that was weird. Like it looked like a box. I guess maybe it's supposed to be like a container for the shot to be in. Excuse me. Is that silver coins and it became cash? Interesting. Okay, who else is the uh, scroll of awaken? Oh shoot! I just literally as soon as I clicked it, I remembered that Wilhelm knows the awaken spell. Okay. I don't really know. What's the best way to go? Is that a diamond ring? Yes, we'll stop and get diamond rings. Three thunder strikes, and that's all it takes. It's interesting. The silver coins is like way better than like normal cash. Okay. I am not digging this thing. Where the heck are we? Okay. Well, it seems like we've come all the way back around. Somehow laid or let cash lay on the ground. And is that a diamond ring? No, it's just silver ring. We'll leave it. Twenty-two bucks. Not worth it. Not worth it in the slightest. Man, I don't understand these walkways. Why what why are we struggling here? Is it because of Samuel? Samuel's like left foot blocking you so much that you can't walk down here. Okay, I'm gonna assume that down here with all these chests and whatnot was kind of the way we needed to go. Already like severely turned around, I feel like. Uh, what do you know? There's a war goal. Okay, let's say what's going on. I can't do anything. I feel like I couldn't even like do what I wanted to do in movement. Shoot. There we go. Cool. All right. This isn't the smoothest thing. I must say, please don't let those be dials, because I don't feel like figuring out and backtracking and everything. It's weird. Why are there silver coins? Is it because they're like... I'm willing to bet that maybe it's because they're like old enemies from the old times. They drop coins, right? And I guess they made a conversion for cash. So that's why we're getting coins all of a sudden after having not seen them for the entire second half of the game. 
Okay. Just want to make sure those aren't switches. We don't have to worry about, like, but going back and forth. What is that? A revolver? I'm not going to worry about that. Why is that only one... One dollar? I don't get this game sometimes. Okay. So I think this is where we entered. We were able to see across... Okay, yeah, this is holy bizarre. Oop. Dread gaze. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay. Why am I struggling so much just to navigate all of a sudden? And why are we getting so many disease vaccines? Now what's the difference between a flamethrower and the incinerator? 40, 33, 20. 30, 33. Okay, so flamethrower is actually better. I might do this for a minute. Maybe that will, uh, what's going on here? Final or see. Okay. That's fine. Unfortunately, we're getting close to being out of time. Even though I feel like I kind of just started. So let's get to a good, clean stopping point. Why am I missing so much? There we go. I love the conveyor belts that are, like, carrying bodies around every once in a while I see one go by. Perfect opportunity. Uh-huh. I'm not even going to pick it up. <laughs> I'm so sick and tired of seeing holy crosses and holy statuettes. Flamethrower? Cool. Who wants this? And a gold ring. Looking back, I should have stupidly... Or, looking back, I stupidly should have bought in a lot more awakens and blood because I mean I even said it I was like I'm pretty sure we're getting close to the end of the game so the fact that I didn't like a stock up our entire inventory on stuff looking back was pretty dumb of me so I can imagine it's only gonna get worse from here is that just a wolf okay now it is a shapeshift been true Wow, someone is doing some actual damage to me. Oh wait, did I not cast it? It's weird. Uh, throwing all the things at the wall just to see what helps us speed this process up. Oh my god, I feel like I'm getting like the worst stuff. Do I want to come up here? Wait, does that one open? I missed a chest? Oh, we haven't been in here yet. God, I hate this layout. <laughs> I feel like I'm so turned around. Quick heal. Oh my god, especially with that guy coming up behind us. Hey Sam, I found you some uh, shotgun shells. Oh, that's weird. I feel like he was dying, but he wasn't like... He was making the sound effects of dying, but wasn't actively dying. Okay. So where the heck are we? Where do we need to go? A SWAT helmet. 
How's this one any better? Just slightly. Wait, did I say not identifying? That probably was something else. Whoa! Not what I really meant to do. Okay, see, now that's $1,500. I don't. <laughs> I legitimately don't understand, like, the logic. And there's a bunch of these ugly guys. Oh, that's cool. I never noticed the problem before that they're out of ammo. Uh, the problem is that I'm kind of debating with now is I, I feel like I'm already so turned around. So if I save and come back to this, I feel like I'm just going to be completely lost. The so part of me kind of just wants to keep pressing for just a little bit. And see what comes of it. Well, that's, that's no good. So let's just ignore them and... Oh, except there's a bunch of guys down here. Yeah, I'm not... I don't think I'm moving Kristoff, or at least not in the way that you think I am. Ooh, that's cool. Somebody cloaked us all. Oh, shoot. I super hate, like, the clicking of the uh, disciplines, because I feel like I miss it way too many times. Wow, there's just so many people. How about this? How about Lily Feeds? She is probably already done with her bloodstones. God, I hate this. What's going on here? Why do I feel like <laughs> everything's kind of just falling apart at the end? There you go, Kristoff. God, I got over so much blood. We're like just sticking our toe in the water here. Okay. I think I'm going to push just a little bit further. And see if we can get to at least the next door. Okay. I don't know if it's me. I feel like I'm clicking on stuff. And they're not going where I want them to go. I'll, I'll casually click a spot on the ground and they're like having a real hard time getting there. Okay. No, it'd probably be safe to save real quick. Okay. So, yeah. Whenever we figure out where we're going, well, there it is. Uh, I think we should backtrack just a little bit. Mostly because I do think that there was some other places we could go. Obviously, we want to open up the crates. Let's see if there's anything good that we can get. And we'll give it to Lily. Probably a good chance that she's going to get diseased or something terrible. I feel like that's our luck at this point in the game. Yeah, and I don't think we came down here, did we? Oh, we did. Okay. See, I am just like... I almost feel like I have no idea where I'm at. After a series of very straight uh, walking... walk through dungeons, I guess. There's nothing here. Wow. Okay, so I backtracked all the way up here. Alright, so... Uh, this is where we're at. In inhibited by our own teammates. There's certain points where I'm like, maybe it'd be easier if I just unselected all of them and just had the one person running. That way there's no chance of them tripping on each other. Okay. 
Yes, we're home. Take us into the next episode. This is definitely where I'm going to be ending things. Okay. Yeah, this is a good spot, I think. Might have left some stuff on the table back there, but man, am I just not really looking forward to sweeping the floors on this place. But thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one where hopefully we can uh, confront Orsi after 800 years of grievances. And yeah, so thanks again for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.